Well, good morning, Shape Up Boot Camps, near and far. Thank you so much. It is Saturday morning. It is time for Total Body Shred. If you're ready, grab a set of free weights, grab your favorite playlist, and let's get moving. Go ahead and start jogging in place if you haven't started moving yet. Let's shake the cobwebs off. Good job. Get loose right here. Good, shake out those arms, maybe some arm circles. Nice. And just some really light high knees. All right, doesn't have to be fast, doesn't have to be extra high. Kind of waking up the core, waking up those glutes and quads. Nice job, and then how about some butt kickers? Take that heel to butt. Good job. How about some little jumping jacks? Heart rate's coming up. Getting ready to experience all those feel-good endorphins. It's gonna be a good day. All right, take some arm circles forward for me. Good job, arm circles forward. Nice, now take it back. Good, take it back. And then one more hug, but maybe bend over this time. Squeeze those shoulder blades together. Nice. Now stand up nice and tall. Let's get those hips going. Out and in, out and in. Good. And in our warm up, we're just getting the muscles prepared for the work we're about to do. So we like to do a lot of dynamic movement, kind of turning things on. Like I said, knocking the cobwebs out. One more. Good, and then give me that swing kick here. Grab a hold of a chair or a child for balance. Nice. And on this next kick, go ahead and grab that heel. Just do a quick quad stretch. Abs are tight and engaged. Maybe that opposite arm goes up for extra balance. Nice, I see you Zoomers, good job, looking good. Bring it through, a little ankle rotation, preparing for jumping which is always optional. You never have to leave the ground if you don't want to. And bring it down, switch, swing kick, other side. It is so good to be here with you today. Thank you so much for coming. It is inspiring and motivating to say the least. All right, grab that quad stretch. We've got several blocks of compound movements for you today. It's gonna be so fun. And bring it through. Ankle rotation, left and right. Nice, and now's the time where you take any last minute stretches you need to take before we get started. Grab some weights, we're starting with some compound movements. All right, we're gonna start with a lot of lower body work. So I'm gonna go ahead and be a little generous here and grab my heavier weights. My feet are about hip width apart, okay? I'm gonna put 80% of the weight on one side. I'm gonna put 20% of the weight on the other side, lifting that heel on the 20% side. We've got 45 minutes of squats. In three, two, one, here we go, 80-20. 80% of the weight on one side, 20% on the other side. 20%, that heel is lifted. Now my chest is up, I'm sitting down, I'm sitting back. Squeeze the glutes on the stand up. 15 seconds gone. 30 left. Good job. Nice. All the way down, all the way up. Give me that squeeze. Warming up here. Hitting those big muscle groups to start. We got 15 seconds left. No break on this. We're going to switch sides right away. Like I said, be generous. These are strong muscles. If you have heavier weights at home, here's a great time to grab them. Three. Two, one, other side, 80, 20. Three, two, one, let's go. Now it's important to use that mind-muscle connection. All right, we can just stand up and down and really not get a ton of benefit unless we're activating, thinking about the muscle groups you're working and adding those intentional squeezes. You're gonna get more bang for your buck and you showed up, 
So why not get 100%? Good job. About 20 seconds left. Down and up. Chest is up, abs are tight. Good, you're really loading up that 80% side. Nice, give me 10 more. Nine, eight, seven, smile, it's Saturday, six, five, come on, four, three, two, and one. Little mini break. Now we're gonna be working the lower body and we're gonna be working the upper body. We're gonna be doing an overhead press. All right, a lunge with a press. Check this out, all right? So it's a, we're gonna wrap our weights up, step back lunge, as that knee lifts through, press up to the sky, step back lunge, lower it down. 45 on the right, 45 on the left. Set it up, weights in front of your face. Three, two, one, here we go. Lunge, knee and press, lunge. Knee and press, good. Now this isn't fast, this is slow and controlled. We've got upper body, core, and lower body all grooving at the same time, okay? You should feel pretty strong in this move. Now, as you bring that knee through, that standing leg is really pushing through the heel and squeezing that glute. Good job, 15 seconds. It'll get you, heart rates are up, yeah? Looking good, Zoomers, come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Other side, other side. Just a tiny little break, okay? Set it up, weights face your face, face your face. Three, two, one, go, down. Up and press, 45 seconds of work. Good job. Exhale, as you lift, as you press. Abs are tight, 30 more. Woo, I love me some compound movements. Working multiple muscles at the same time. Good job. 10 more, you can do it. I know it's hard, I know you're tired, but those last few reps should be hard. Recover, whoo, shake it out. All right, jog in place as you watch. I need to demo this. All right, you're gonna bring it down to the floor, Reverse tabletop, all right? Now right here, you can work your triceps, bending at the elbows, straightening up. We are also gonna work on shuffling the booty back and then back up to tabletop. Bring your butt between your hands, push back up. So it's kinda like a swing. If you can't do that, give me those tricep dips. All right, everybody bring it down on the ground. Hands down, fingertips face your heels. Wrists under shoulders. Lift up, reverse tabletop, abs are tight. Now you can just do your tricep dip or straighten out your legs. Shove the butt back, reverse tabletop, go. Back and through. This is super hard. We got a ton of tricep, shoulder, and core work. And then we've got that butt squeeze in that reverse tabletop. Good job. Good, make sure if you're doing your um, tricep dips, you're not just moving your hips, you're actually bending at the elbow. 15 seconds. Good job, what doesn't challenge you, doesn't change you. Let's go, five, four, Three, two, one. Shake out those wrists. Shake it out, good job. All right, if you have light weights, we're gonna do a squat with a cross punch. If your weights are too heavy to do that, 
Give me no weights, okay? 45 seconds, abs are tight. Hit the corners of the room. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Punch. Good. So you're working that middle. Don't be afraid to pivot, to twist a little. This is great for the shoulders, biceps, triceps, of course the core. Now my weights are a little heavier, so I'm going a little bit slower. If your weights are pretty light or you're doing no weight, you can pick it up. Good job, come on, 30 seconds. Let's go shape up. Good job, come on, dig deep right here. 15. Woo! Come on. To the end. Five, four, three, two, one. 45 second drills today, all day. Good job. All right, getting ready for a little cardio blast, okay? So we're going to do a burpee. When you rise up from your burpee, give me a switch. Jump lunge, and then go back down. Modification, stay right here, and give me those lunges. All right, 45 seconds to work. 45 seconds to grit it out. Burpee, switch, jump, lunge at the top, right, left. In five, four, crank up that music. Go, down, up, switch. Again, hit the deck, come on. Good job. Well, these will shut me right up, don't they? Whew. Fifteen! Come on, you can do it. shape up shows up time for a breath all right get your breath Whew. in through the nose out through the lips all right we're going to an upper body section okay so make sure you grab if you have multiple weights at home you've got them close by so that you can drop set if you need to if all you have is one set of weights We'll make that work all right extra squeezes okay so we are going to do a one arm press one arm front raise all right 45 seconds fatiguing that muscle and then we switch sides all right it's kind of like patting your head and rubbing your tummy it's kind of hard to do two things at the same time all right ready so press and front raise five four Three, two, one, here we go. Now we are slow and controlled. That front raise, I don't want it lifting higher than shoulder height. Abs are engaged, helping you control. Use your breath here. Nice. 15 seconds. Shape up, let's go. Let's work. We've got five, four, three, two, one. Switch, okay? So now other arm is pressing, overhead press. The other arm is front raising. Three, two, one, 45. Are we sweating yet? I am dripping. We want to be strength training at least three times a week with muscle building activities. And you can do that through weight training, body weight training, kettlebell training. You can just have a set of tubing at home. 
If I was to buy just one thing, if I had nothing, I would buy just a set of tubing. Because you can work every muscle in your body with tubing. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake it out. All right, that was upper body. We're gonna go back down, more compound movements. This is lower body, I love this move. You can add weight if you want to, but we're gonna do a lateral lunge, push the butt back, straighten out that other side, center, side, center. So I'm never fully standing up, all right? We're working the glute medius, the glutes, the hamstrings, and those abductors, all right? I'm gonna grab one weight, and I'm just gonna hold it on each end and call it a day, ready? 45 seconds. Nice wide stance. Three, two, one. Lateral lunge low, center squat. Lateral lunge low, center squat. Lunge, center, lunge, center. Now we're never fully standing up. Push that rear end back on those lateral lunges. Chest is up, abs are tight. Can you get nice and low? Low, 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 30 seconds. We just got all kinds of goodies today. Hey, I tell you what, I don't know about you, but after last week, my lower body was sore for days and days and days. Woo, here we go, five, four, three, Two, one. Oh, stand up, shake it out. Check this out, love this move. It's a bent over row to hammer curl. So bending over about 45 degrees, knees are soft. Row those elbows straight up, squeeze the shoulder blades. Then stand up, hammer curl. Row, hammer curl. Row, hammer curl. All right, pick your weights. All right, pick your weights. Three. Two, one, here we go. Flat back row, stand up, hammer curl. All right, squeeze those shoulder blades together. Weights are vertical. So I'm taking one end of the weight all the way up to my shoulders and lowering it down. Good, 30 seconds. Come on, squeeze. Nice. Take your time, make it count. Give me 10. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice job, shake it out. Whew. All right, now this one is a little tricky as well. I'm gonna go lightweight. I'm gonna windmill my hand up, do a tricep extension, switch hands, windmill it down. Windmill up, tricep extension, windmill it down. Okay, the pass off is the tricky part, okay? It can feel a little awkward, roll with it. All right, good range of motion, shoulder, shoulder girdle work. Five, four, three, two, one. Windmill up, tricep extension. Switch hands, windmill it down. Up, elbows face me, face the screen. Good, windmill, tricep, switching down. Good, nice. Beautiful. All right, you got 15 seconds. Good job. If you have any rotator cuff or shoulder injury, old or new, this would be great to do without any weight and just work on that range of motion. Five, four, three, two, one, recover. You guys ready to sweat? Huh, you guys ready to sweat? All right, check it out. We got burpees again, but when you rise up, give me eight high knees. Burpees, high knees, burpee, high knees. All right, 45 seconds to work. Let's go, shape up now. Burpee, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, burpee. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, burpee. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Come on. Ten seconds. Come on, get it. 
more. Nice job. Whew. Catch your breath. Nice. All right, recovering so we can keep going. We're doing a deadlift to squat. One of each, back and forth. Heavy weight if you have the option. All right, if not, don't worry about it. Just give me those extra squeezes, extra intentionality, okay? Heavy weight. Whew. I'm gonna go with my, my 15s. So deadlift, nice flat back, weight is in the heels. Stand up, squeeze the glutes. Then give me a low deep squat, push through the heels, stand up. All right, three, two, one. Deadlift, squat. Weight sneak in front for that deadlift. Open up through the chest. Make sure you're not bent over. Use those legs, not your back. Good. Come on. We got this. 15 seconds. Good. Good job. Five, four, three, two, one. Hold your weights by your side. All right. Here we go, team. Squat down, bend your legs, chest open. Lateral, side step, two to the right, two to the left. Rest your weights on the outside of your legs. Adding resistance, 45 seconds. Everybody is low. Three, two, one, here we go. Rest those weights on the outside of your legs. Good, side to side, one, two, stay low, one, Two, can you get lower? Chest up, use your legs, not your back. Come on. 30 more, 30 seconds, come on. Lower, work through it, come on. Work through it. When life gets tough, how do you hit back? Let your workouts transcend into all areas of your life. You are strong. You are resilient. You're a fighter. Five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful. Carefully set your heavy weights down. Shake it out for just a second. All right, this one's fun as well. Weights are optional. I'm gonna do one heavy weight holding on both ends. It's a split lunge, nice and low. Even if you can tap that knee to the ground, awesome. Then activate your glutes, activate your legs, and lift a straight leg up. So it's down, lift. Doing that lift, we're working the entire posterior chain. We're working our low back, our glutes, and our hamstrings. So we're activating back here. This is important. 45 each side, weights are optional. Split lunge setup. Sit up tall, abs are tight, go. Get low, lift. Get low, lift. So straight down, straight up. Now how high can you lift? Don't just give me a kind of half effort here. Really lift that leg. It looks simple, but guys, we are firing here. Find your breathing. Good job. 15 seconds. Hello. Whoo. <laughs> you guys are doing great. And recover. So now we're just going to shake it out. Ah! Shake it out and switch. Let's work that back side. Five, four, chest up. Three, two, go. Straight down, straight up and back. Can you get that back leg to touch the floor? If not, it's okay. It's something to think about. Something to work towards. Let's keep going. Just feels right. 
right, doesn't it? It's like, yeah, I'm working some stuff. 15, 15. got a cardio blast. Guess what it involves? Yup, burpees. <laughs> Only reason I'm doing it is because you're here with me or else I wouldn't be doing it. So it's a burpee and when you stand up, jab cross. Burpee, other side, jab cross. All right, don't overthink it. Have some fun, throw some punches, get some aggression out. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Down, hit the deck. Up, jab cross. Down, other side. Jab cross. Come on, throw those punches. Throw those punches. Boom, boom. Use your body. 30 seconds. I'm watching. Oh, nice. Yes. Throw it, throw it. You got 10. Nine. Eight. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Get your towel. Nice job. Good stuff. How are we doing, Shape Up? All right. We're going to move to some cardio core. All right, every move is gonna be about 40 seconds with a 20 second recovery to help us transition. All right. All right, so first move is a stand up runner. Split legs. Now what I'm gonna do is sink low, like I'm trying to hide under a table, if you will. All right, then I'm gonna bring my knee in and back pumping my arms. So we're working our heart and we're working our core. All right, 40 seconds, 40 seconds other side, 20 second recovery, then we go down to bicycles, just so you know. Are you ready? Three, two, go. All right, so that stabilizing leg, that knee is bent. All right, you are working your quads and hamstrings. Now, once you get comfortable, Pick up your pace. Halfway, 20 seconds. Lower, get lower. Come on, drive those elbows back. 10. Ah, come on, we got five, four, three, two, one. No break, switch, go. Stay low. Come on, crunch that knee in. Drive those elbows. Nice, strong back. If your back is bothering you, pull your core in. Come on. Halfway. Pick it up. Five, four, three, two, one. transition bring it down for bicycles 40 seconds bicycles lower the legs are the harder it is straighter they are the harder it is modification work on your crunch ready hands behind the head big twist knee to elbow lay down five four three two one let's go So I've got my upper back off the floor. My legs are low. They can be here, but try to straighten them out and touch that elbow to that knee. Halfway, 20 more. Find your breathing. 
position for a mountain climber. Give me a standing alternating knee crunch. Get ready. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Knees in, right left, right left. Butts are down. You got 40 seconds. Remember that modification, ladies and gentlemen, is right here. All right, if you need it, use it. 20 more, 20 more, come on. Let's go, let's go. Nice. Five, four, three, two, one. Recover. All right, flipping it over, we're working our obliques. Stay down on the ground for me. All right. So side plank, hand and wrist are under the shoulder. Stack your feet if you can. Modification is right here. Knee down under the hip. Once you set up your side plank, reach that top arm under, give yourself a hug, and extend back up. All right, if you need another modification, give me a basic side crunch. All right, five, four, three, two, one. So here's your side plank. Reach under, hug, and reach. This is advanced. This is hard. Remember to build your foundation with planks and holds before you even start moving. So if you're really struggling, you can just hold it here. 10 seconds. Good job. All right, and then as you get stronger, and you will, you can start doing this stuff. Five, four, three, two, one. Shake out that wrist, I know that's tough. That wrist will get stronger too. Let's go other side. Set it up. All right, ready? Here we go, side plank with a hug. Love yourself. Come on. Nice. So one side might feel a little stronger, a little more stable, totally normal. Good job, 20 seconds more. Beautiful, strong foundation. Three, two, one. Shake out those wrists, 20 second transition. You've got 40 seconds of plank jacks. On your forearms or on your straight arms, I don't care. Modification, just stand up and jack, ready, five, Four, three, two, one, plank jack. Out and in. You could also tap it for a modification. Halfway. Come on, come on, dig deep. Don't quit, don't quit. Ten. sprinkling in that cardio in between. Yes, good. Lift, lift, lift. Row it back. I know this is hard. 15 seconds. Good. Beautiful. Beautiful. 
recover. Hands beside the armpits. Give me a little upward dog. Give me a little child's pose. Stand up. We are gonna repeat that. We're going to do an AMRAP and then you are done. All right, so let's start off with those low runners. All right, so split lunge. Join me when you're ready, shape up. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Come on. Now you know these exercises. They are only 40 seconds. All right? Come on, drive. 10 are gone. Can you get lower? Can you pump harder? I know you're tired. This is where you gotta fight. Come on. You got 10 more seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Other side, set it up. We go right now, 40. Tell Alexa to turn that music up. Come on, we got a strong finish. I don't leave people behind. Let's go. 10 more, 10 more. Get lower. You should be feeling that in that supporting leg. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo! Bicycles. Transition down. You got 20 seconds to transition down. All right. Give me your bicycles. Five, four, three, two, one. Here we go. Big twist, big twist. Come on, you're getting your second win for that strong finish. at 
all. This is easy, right? Ha! I think I feel it everywhere. If you're super strong, you could even add a top leg lift a few times just for a little balance challenge. Okay, so it's sixes. Six goblet squats, six goblet hops, six push-ups. How many rounds can you get done in six minutes? Okay, so check it out. Here's the goblet squat. Toes are out, hold your weight in front. All right, squeeze through your heels, chest is up. So you'll do six of these, then you can continue to hold your weight or you can set it down, it's up to you. And I want you to just do a mini hop for six. Then you're gonna set it down and you're gonna give me any style of push-up. On your knees, on your toes, it's up to you, okay? Six, 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 six minutes, okay? This is your finisher, all right? This is when most people say, yeah, I, I gotta go Gotta go run some errands, my kids need me. But not you, not you. All right, this is what we're gonna do together. I'm just getting my six minute timer out. All right, set a goal in your head. How many rounds do you think you can do? Hold it up on your fingers, Zoomers. What do you think? How many rounds? Five rounds, Mala, yes. Did I see six? Ooh, that would be cool, six for the sixes. All right, are you ready, shape up? Give me thumbs up. Five, four, three, two, go. Six goblet squats, chest up. Now what you wanna make sure is we're tired. Don't use your back, use your legs, you're up tall. Now six hops. Four, five. Six, you carefully set it down for six push-ups. Any style, wide, narrow, knees, toes, you can change it every time. 
Then you just simply stand up. You set yourself up and then you go again. Don't start squatting until you've got your proper form. I love finishing with an AMRAP. It seems so impossible. It's when the athlete comes out inside of you. And if you're here, you're an athlete. And athletes give it all they got in the fourth quarter, right? This is your fourth quarter. Score is tied. Just always remembering to be careful between your transitions. Don't rush through them. Going to the knees. My form just felt a little off, and I'd rather have good form. If you're watching this on YouTube, I hope my counting's right. Whew. Five, six. I go quiet, I am just letting you focus, enjoy your music, and get some work done. I'm on round six, no, five, this is round five. Let's kick it up, Mala. You're gonna crush five, all right? stronger than sloppy form and hurt myself. Remember, if you're really fatiguing, you can drop that weight. I had to check my form. I was looking down, wasn't I? No, no, no. Eye gaze is looking out and down. Ah, you guys didn't need to walk today, did ya? <laughs> Four, five, chest up, abs tight. Remember, mind muscle connection. Don't just go through those motions. Someone who can't work out right now. 
dedicate it to your kids so they see what it means to be strong, disciplined, and resilient. Get off those blood pressure meds. Reverse diabetes. The list goes on. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh. 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 Whew. Keep moving. Keep moving. Catch your breath. That was freaking awesome. Oh, you should see my zoomers. <sighs> Killing it. Oh. All right. You're moving. You're not standing still. We're letting that heart rate, breath rate, blood pressure start to slow down. Control it with your breath in through the nose, out through the lips. Give me a big deep breath in with your breath. Exhale out. In. Exhale out. In. Exhale out. Good. Feeling a little better. Feeling a little more recovered with each breath. Good. Now shrug your shoulders up by your ears. Take them back. Take them down. Forward. Up, back, down, forward, up, back, down. One more, forward, up, back, down. One arm across. Take that shoulder away from, or that ear away from the shoulder. I like to do a little side neck stretch here. Pulling that arm into the chest. Oh, we hold, now we hold. At the end of our workout, we hold our static stretches. Nice. Oh yeah, a little side to side, feels good. Release. Let's go other side, across the body, scoop under, pull into the chest. Maybe that neck stretch if it feels okay. I am so proud of you, Shave Ups, today. You crushed tons of crazy moves. All compound movements requiring a ton of thinking, a ton of core engagement, and you crushed it. Okay, this wasn't easy. Some of these moves might have been really challenging, some of them might have been really easy. The purpose is you did variety and you changed it up, and that's what your body needs to get stronger. Okay, quad stretch. So if you're looking for that kind of workout throughout the week, you're in the right place. <laughs> that's what Shape Up does. That's why I sought to instruct here because variety, conditioning, and you know just the community, of course. We thank you so much. Take it across figure four for supporting Shape Up during this time with your virtual memberships. It is, it is huge. Continue to support small businesses, support your local studios. Thank you for supporting me and being here. It is I have two instructors in my Zoom class switch, Linda and Leanne, right now, and I, it is not easy to teach a class, first of all, live. And I've been doing it for 18 years, and I still get nervous. And I think it's because we care. I think nerves mean you care. But then coming in and just having all the technical side to it, figure four, and wondering if it's set up right, and wondering if they can hear me and see me, and is it too confusing what I'm doing? Are they hitting it? It's just a lot to think about. So. Thank you from the bottom of my heart for being here. Good, go ahead and give me a split stretch here. Take that back heel down to the ground, pressing through to that front hip flexor. I'm gonna go arms behind. Squeeze that back glute. Oh, I think I could just sit like this all day, that feels good. I'm gonna open up through my chest. Good, release other side. We'll do one or two more stretches. This time I'm gonna go overhead, pressing my back heel down, getting a little deeper in that front leg. Good, go ahead and release. 
All right, nice and wide here. We're just gonna sink down into a wide squat. Roll it through and up, all the way up through the shoulders. Again, flat back down, press up, shoulder roll back. Nice. One more. Good. Give me two more big deep breaths in. I want you to take in all that is good and decide that today is going to be a good day. Inhale and exhale. Give yourself a hand.